What's going on guys, this is Jake and in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can set up custom URL redirects inside of your Shopify store. So this is going to be useful if you just transferred your store over from another platform, maybe like WordPress, Squarespace, etc. And Shopify does tend to use different types of URLs. So if you have old URL configurations to say certain product pages or collection pages that you want to redirect to your new pages on Shopify, I'm going to show you how to do that in this video. And this is also going to be useful if you are changing the actual URL links inside of existing links on Shopify. So really quick before we get into it, if you do want to run giveaways on your Shopify store or set up wholesale pricing on your Shopify store, be sure to check out my two apps by clicking the links in the description down below. And with that said, let's jump right into it. Let's take a look at an example of what we're doing here. So if we open up this t-shirt product here on this page in this test store here, we can see that the URL is the store name right here and then it's slash products slash t-shirt. So this is just something that Shopify does. So all of their products in the URL will be slash product slash t-shirt. And it's the same thing for collections. So it would be like your URL slash collections and then the collection name. So previously, let's say your t-shirt product here was just your URL.com slash t-shirt. So like if I were to get rid of that here, we can see that this page is leading to nothing. So you may have shared this link in previous advertising on previous social media posts, etc. It might be on other websites. So if you just transfer it over, you're going to want this old URL to link to your new URL right here. So to do that, all you have to do is come inside Shopify here and click on online store and come down here to navigation. And then we need to click on view URL redirects. And then we can either import URL redirects or we can create one. So in this case, we're going to create a URL redirect. So we're going to redirect from this link right here. And then we are going to redirect to this new page right here. And then we just click on save redirect. Now, if we were to test this out, now if I were to come over here and I erase products once again, and I click on enter, we can see that it automatically redirects us to this URL and this page right here. So that's how we can create redirects within Shopify. Now, one interesting thing that you can also do is if you are updating your links within Shopify, you can have this done automatically. So let's say we came over to our products and I opened up this t-shirt right here and I were to scroll down and we were to edit our search engine listing right here. And this is where we can change the URL handle. Let's say I were to change this to t-shirt new. We can see that right here, it's going to give us an option to automatically create a URL redirect for the existing t-shirt right here to t-shirt new. So anytime you update your links within Shopify, you can create the URL redirect automatically, which is pretty cool and simple. But if you had these URLs from an existing store on another website builder, then you're going to have to create it manually like we just did. So with that said, that's how you can create custom URL redirects inside of your Shopify store. If you found this video helpful, be sure to leave it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for more videos, check out my apps by clicking the link in the description down below, and I will see you guys in the next one.